Oh, okay. Let's just go ahead and get this started. I don't really feel excited about this, but we're going to do it. I'm kind of excited. I don't know why I even decided to play this. Uh, by the way, let me know if you have any audio issues. Stream quality is good. Harass me in the chat. I am all about that. Of course this. There we go. All right. Yeah, I don't care. Oh my god. This is Resident Evil Village, or Village Resident Evil. And let me tell you, I was just getting all my settings, actually there's one setting I forgot now that I think about, um, getting all my settings set up, and I already hate this, just because... Scroll wheel inversion, okay. No, I'm not playing with controller. Do I not have buttons inversion? Scroll wheel inversion. Is there no? Oh, yeah, and you can tell this was built for console players because the key bindings make no sense in the um, in the UI here. Um, please tell me I can invert my mouse. Okay, here we go. Good. Uh, invert Y and invert Y. And yeah, that all looks. F Camera wobble on. Oh, yeah, that's fine. It's nice that they have that accessibility setting. But yeah, but right click to go back. F to go ahead, F to say okay, and <clears throat> delete to quit. Delete to quit. Why delete to quit? That makes no effing sense. I... <laughs> Console developers. But I have a PS4 over here, but I don't have a streaming capture. But then I have this nice high-end PC that I can get RTX on and play at uh, 1440p, yada, yada, yada. So that's what we're going to do. Okay, and I've never played a Resident Evil game in my life. Never even played one. I've seen one played. I have friends who are absolutely in love with the series. Me, not so much. I just don't care about horror stuff. Um, let's just go with standard. <coughs> I should probably go on casual, but you know what? It's okay. All right. Now Long we get ago, this nice little picture a young girl book. went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. My girlfriend would love that she's a huge to the berries, Tim Burton the fan, so this intro just ties right and into that. Into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Bat Lord appeared. He That's greeted her warmly bat. and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank That's the not thick, creepy at all. dark blood and smiled with joy. But that's the point, Passing I suppose. It is a horror menacing game. Menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned cold. I wonder if this is going cold. to go for like the, the startling jump the horror, clothes. or the then, uh, a dark weaver actual appeared. scary. And with a click of his fingers, crafted mist. One thing I hate is a lot of games rely on jump horror, you know, startling you and stuff. Yourself, he coaxed. Um, so she clothed her system shock did and that smiled with joy but it did it well and then it also had just creepy atmosphere Across waters deep and ominous she in went. general is really well Hoping done a boat she found would carry her home that's about as close but as I get to enjoying horror and her games heart grew with heavy. system shock <clears throat> old system shock and yes that dates appeared, me quite a bit I played of his many the fins. old system shock come child eat your fill so the girl ate and smiled with joy once more Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful, 
golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Oh, snap. That Terror girl. filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Hm. All right. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. That hair in sucks. Blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. Yeah, the rendering of the hair asleep. sucks. I am just going to criticize the living what crap out of this. The creepy story. She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. <laughs> Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it. Thank God. Future she prediction. So that she In a new Resident that, Evil, that baby is going to become a bad guy. Memory. Oh. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Well, considering this is the eighth in the series, it's okay to be both paranoid and cautious. I'll finish dinner. I think the character you play is from the previous. Uh, I, from what I remember reading. But it's yeah, you're not going to have a normal life, dude. You're just going to be dealing with random memory. shit. I can't blame her. Oh, oh, I actually get to do something. Did All you right. say something? Nothing. No. I'll put no. her down. All right. Let's look around. Yeah. I really didn't play much with the settings. I turned it up to, um, not max, but just below max graphics settings. And honestly, it doesn't look that great. But it could take some more tweaking. I mean, frame rate's fantastic, but where am I supposed to put this thing? I wasn't paying attention. Don't put the baby there. Okay. Go in here. Okay, yeah. Upstairs. I mean, the details in some of this is nice. I do have RTX on, by the way. Yeah, I'm, I'm also... In case you didn't know, I'm not a huge fan of babies. It's like I said to your mom. So that this is just double the horror you. for me. You know, babies are great for some people, not for me. Um, okay, do I go there or do I go here? Do not, nope. <laughs> that is not a place for the baby. We, we are not going to create a new kind of horror and not show you that I am a horrible person who would drown a baby. Because I am not, of course. I just because I don't like babies doesn't mean I want them dead. I know babies are important. And this is <coughs> Okay. Try to do a deep clean before Rose starts walking around. Yeah, well, we're in the Okay. Am I not am I missing something here? I may have supposed to go through here. That's fine. We're right exploring. There, Okay, yep, we're on the right path here. Enter the door magically. Um, aha. And there's a... a big old ball that makes noise. Okay. Oh, you're not going to say you're just going to have it. There's a subtitle. You're not going to do the fallout thing. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. Yeah. That's interesting looking. I mean, this performs great. Nice shadows there. That looks good. Yeah. What's in here? my office <laughs> Mia and I had another fight I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me <laughs> well <laughs> yeah perish the thought we bring up the past considering this game series and how many times you've dealt with crap but whatever 
Do 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 do. Yeah, whatever. I am not playing for the story. Fine. Gun survivalist, a heavy Some firearms manual. Really to get you. <laughs> See? <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> I mean, I love the reflections on that. That's really nice quality there. All right. That's enough nostalgia here. Can I run? No, I can't. Assuming shift is run. Shift better be run. If, if they screw with the controls too much, I'm not going to be a happy camper. All right, let's go. Bread looks tasty. There's my wife. Oh, okay. Now it's taking over controls. Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Oh, that food looks good. Mmm, that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de la gum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Mm. Local wine, too. But if yeah. you're gonna keep sulking all I had evening, frozen pizza for dinner. Maybe you shouldn't have and any. baby carrots with hummus. You really have to stop worrying. And that's it. It's just no wine. You just Indiana, the pregnancy. Water. Chris mm. moving us here. Joy's being on a diet. Training, it all happened so fast, you know. Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously? be. Seriously think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened nope. so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so... Whoa. <sighs> Sniper. Mia, get down. How'd that shot? Mia! Okay. I love how you're not even flipping the table up. And you just don't get hit. Just her. Mia. Oh, God. Hello, buddy. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! What? Oh, snap. Why? <clears throat> yeah, why? You know this guy, and you're surprised that he would do this, so... Oh. <laughs> okay. Go on, move! Oh, shut up, you jack wagon. Ah, oh, they're taking my baby. All clear. Rose? A dango the took hell my you baby. With my package secure, sir. The package, Take of course. Away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Listen to that voice. <laughs> Baby. Get him out here. They're not following COVID social distancing protocols. By the way, in case you didn't notice, I am wearing my wear a mask, you ship mouth ass hat t shirt available for sale at classicwfl.com. Wear a mask or Umbrella Corp will infect the world with coronavirus. See, I do know a little bit. I'm pretty sure it's Umbrella Corp. Who's the big bad? Hey, Doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. Next Thursday, 4 o'clock. I can do that. That was the that was doc. doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? Nah, she's, she's we with matter, Greg. Ethan. Whoa. You matter. You just Mia, what are you, what are you talking, talking about? about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. Work. Work, work, work. 
I can understand prioritizing work. No, he's a little baby. No, is work calling again? Am I lying in a pool of cocaine? Because that's what it looks like. I know I'm not. But it looks like I'm just lying Jesus. in a pile of cocaine. It does look pretty, though. No, a charred corpse. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is it? Where is Rose? Secure channel. You're not fucking What? Secure channel? It's a cell phone Fuck. with the the call crap on there and whatever. You know what? Suspension of disbelief. Oh, I, I magically have a light. Probably attached to my dong, I'm guessing, based on the position of the light. Okay. Okay, they're taking me out somewhere. Let's just admire... Man, the frame rate is just spectacular. I could probably bump this up even more. We'll see when I get to some actual gameplay. But let's follow the tracks. That shadow looks pretty good. All right. Um, gotta move in slow. Come on. Waiting for a jump scare. Anytime now, there's gonna be something fall, swing by, or run by, and it'll be like, holy shit, what is that? I don't know. I don't know. Come on. Okay. You gonna tell me how to crouch? C for crouch. Okay, it's a toggle. And of course, the, uh, ow. That looked good. See, when crouching to stand up. Okay, we got crouching. So, if this has any stuff, whoops, see? That wasn't very startling, though. But I did call it. I did call it. There'll be more. They're gonna play on the assumption. Ooh. Ah, there's the some animal that's growling. Man, those dead crows, I assume. It's a rendered really freaking well. Ah, ah. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Walk through the hanging dead crows. Squish. Splurt. Where? That one's not dead. Holy shit. See. I don't care, buddy. Okay, I can't hardly see. Okay. <clears throat> Come on. Well, see? There's something running across the screen. Two of the three I called. Well, more than... Was it three? I can't remember. God, I just want to go all Splinter Celly and toggle my night vision goggles here. Go wee! Oh. Okay, we're to this here. Okay. Ah, here's a door. Oh, and then all the outside noise just disappears, so that makes sense. Ooh, we got a drawer. Let's open it. Ooh, some rope. Can I not take the rope? For a sec, I thought that was a bunch of dead rats. No, it's potatoes. All right. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah. Examine it. Nothing. Bunch of murky water. That's fine. It's all good. Mmm. Old pills. Eye dropper. Sudafed. That looks like the Sudafed blister pack right there. And the spoon. Just a few more things in this. Ooh. <laughs> Scary sounds. Alright. Got some clothes. 
clothes and yep there's nothing that I can do with any of that so whatever I guess I'm just in here let's keep on walking keep on walking Ooh, go down the stairs into the pretty basement with the nice reflective wet stuff that wet rock that's the uh, specular maps are very much reminiscent of uh, Skyrim and Fallout. Detail quality, it's it's better, but not that much better. You, know, you can still see the pixelation of the specular maps. But you know what? I'm not going to hate it for that. Ooh, what's this? Okay. Rotate it. Yeah, okay. Crazy creepy lady with the halo. I like that I get to see the... That's interesting that it's got a canvas print style and reflection in such a small picture. And it's not actually stretched canvas over something. That doesn't make any sense. For those of you who are watching and don't know, I am an artist. I did make at least part of my living as a... <gasps> digital and physical artist. I do have artwork for sale on my website. Um, all prints, though. I don't have any originals for sale. Um, those I typically reserve for galleries. Oxford. Something's going on. Okay, so, well, okay, all that happened, so is there anywhere else I can go around here? I'm just trying to follow the, uh, tracks here. I'm guessing I probably have to go back up. There's another picture. We'll say, though, um, acrylics and stuff like that is, and pearl oil even, is not my bailiwick when it comes to painting. I prefer watercolors. Ooh, okay. I just walk up to it and I'll crawl down under it. That's fine. But there is no prone button. What in the hell? That, that's not my blood. I thought, at least. I mean, I did cut my hand earlier, but... What did all this? Yeah, who did all this? Or what did all this? Okay. Ooh, there's a hole in the wall now. Let's go on through. Alright, I can see a little better outside now. W is climb over, which is also just walk forward, so... <laughs> no real reason to uh, label that. Just automatically does it. You know, I get horror games like Resident Evil are supposed to be like an immersive storytelling type experience, but where the hell am I? Yeah, where the hell am I? That's pretty. Frame rate's still good out in the open with this. One thing that bugs me is a lot of like. And rendering of stuff like limbs, like you notice it's a flat texture and stuff, and so it just kind of looks eh. And this is even playing in a really high quality setting. But, I don't know. Leaves and stuff. Oop. Here we go. Breakpoint slide. Oh, shit balls. Okay. A oh, dead horse. That apparently is still warm, so it was freshly killed since steam is rising from it. Creaking. Random sounds. And. Now, oh, clothes of something. Check in here. Okay. Maybe, maybe they're out? Food that. Maybe, that looks pretty gross, but it's still cooking. That looks pretty gross. Something tore the shit out of this place. Is there anything I can interact with? Nope. Let's just keep on moving. Uh, the bulk of the stream is going to be set up for the game. I know I'm not actually going to get to play play. But you know what? Whatever. It's fine. We'll make a do. Blood. Cages for 
animals. I'm assuming pigs there. I don't know. Area's kind of small for horses. Some blood here. This is probably... Yeah, nothing there. Some blood. Now. Yeah. Oh, space puts my hands up. I assume that's like the, the whole block maneuver thingy. And I do not enter sign. Hit the padlock. Which I can just bump into. That's interesting. Well, I can't get too close and bump into it. It's over here. Nothing. Alright, keep on walking. Ooh. Ominous shit. Well. Oh, of course. Creepy stuff, and there's some random noises above me, it sounded like. <clears throat> I love how it doesn't voice his internal monologue. And by love it, I mean, like, why not voice his internal monologue? You've got this act voice actor here who's doing all sorts of other dialogue. Do I go this way? I think I go this way. There's a tractor. Oh, it's still kind of going. Let's hop on it, go for a ride. What happened? Oh. Poor goat. Man. Oh. Graveyard workshop ceremony site. Alright, so. Some interesting sounds in the background. Bing bong. I'm gonna play drums on those pans. Can't go in there, what does that say? Locked due to missing homeowner, okay, that makes sense. All the homeowners are missing, there's that there with that fancy symbol, but I'm gonna go over here with the creaking door in the darkness. Alright. And... Ooh. Good choice. I've got a knife. The life of the wife was ended by the knife. All right. Did they just run out of the house? God, that looks gross. I think it's a requirement that everything has to be rusted over in like abandonment stuff even if it was recent abandonment which given the re freshly killed horse it would make sense there's recent abandonment like why is everything rusted Shit. over and what <coughs> let me out nope can't go out that way i guess i'm stuck in here oh <coughs> i can break stuff Ooh. Cool, okay. Ha. Huh. Oh, wait, maybe I'm supposed to go through here. Now. Yeah. No, no, oh. friendly, friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down the road and... What's going on? He looks good. His hair looks a lot better than the than my wife's hair. Oh no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? You have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Take it! All right, I have a gun. Hey, hey, are you listening? Hey! Did he drop his gun? Because I'm gonna take his gun too. What? You know he was gonna die. 
Gotta love how the blood is just bright red. Bright red. Oh, there we go. Dead body? Okay. Wait, there's more. Bunch of dead bodies. Wait, did I come through the... Oh, yeah, I came through the floor. That makes sense now. Okay. So he's got a bunch of corpses down here. Okay. Salmon. Pick him up by his hair. Pull that shit up. And get freaked out. Jesus Christ. Just called it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What the hell is wrong with this place? Texture of that guy's jacket looks weird. Huh. Oh. There's something moving up there. What is that? Oh. Get off and I quit biting my hand, damn it. God, that's... What the fuck was that? Yeah, what the fuck? Okay. Come on, let me shoot him. No. Don't just... S S <laughs> yeah, he's clearly not listening to you, dude. Shoot him in the face. Okay. I, okay. I hit space to guard. What are you doing? Okay, I hit space to guard, so. Reload. Okay, well, there, that got him finally. What the hell? Yeah. Alright. I'm gonna crouch because I am a stealth gamer and so stealth gamers like to crouch a lot I can't reload anymore can I go out this way um I can't use that here yep that's Resident Evil I know that's classic where Resident Evil is having a bunch of random cr crappy objects Presumably looking for key. Were bolt cutters? That'll work. All right. Yeah, use random objects on things. That's classic adventure game trope. I used to uh, play those all the time. You know, you had the pl old school police quest back in the day. Um, leisure shoot, leisure, leisure suit, Larry. Once again, dating myself. I know I don't look that old, but I am. Am I going? No, I'm going the wrong way. It's over here. That's where I need to go. Let's double check. In is it in here? I hadn't been yet. Chem fluid. Okay. I assume that's my health. Crafting. Can't craft anything. Oh. No, I can. Oh, no, I'm missing the herb. I have no treasure. Alright, tab closed, that's fine. Oh, we got herb now. First aid. Okay. There we go. Alright, I have officially crafted something now. Yeah, I did that. Okay. Here's where I go. Okay. Let's use the bolt cutters. It'll be interesting if they disappear from my inventory after I use them. Let's check. Yeah, they do. Of course they do. Because bolt cutters you can only use once, apparently. Ooh, that 
texture work looks crappy. Hmm. I want to aim down the iron sights, dang it. <clears throat> That's bugging me. Oh, dragging a corpse in there. Oh, there's a doggy house. Which I'm not going to turn off. Oh. To turn it off on its own. Handgun ammo, yes. Blood dripping from the ceiling. Not really dripping, but pouring from the ceiling. <sighs> oh, hello. Let's just startle you with a bunch of random crap. That's fine. Oh, and take me out of Crouch, why don't you? Pick up. Pick up. Yeah, startle horror. Come on. Let's actually, you know. Upstairs here. Over. Okay. Well, interesting. Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? House near the fields. Alright, let's you know what? Let's go ahead and use my first aid. There we go. There we go, buddy. All right. Here's the fields. Let's see, do I have a map? Yeah, I do. Okay. That's fine, whatever. Close. He's watching me. How about that? I don't want to fall with blood. Let's go this way and see what happens. Oh, hey there, buddy. Yeah, I'll leave you alone. Oh, boy. Yeah, they really want me to go this way. Okay. Ooh, handgun ammo. Only six rounds. But it's better than nothing. Let's see here. Okay, one, two. Alright, so. Go up here. Four. They don't sound too happy about me being here. There we go. All right. Okay. Damn it. Gunpowder. Sweet. Gracious. 
flower. Them. Yeah, I know. Let's just go ahead and keep running, I guess. Oh, hello. Oh, arrows, nice. Now nope, keep running. They're hurting me this way. Wait, I just came through here. What's in here? Locked. Over here. Nope. I'm not gonna attack that. Because all I have is a knife. Oh, hello. God damn. That's a big old beef cake. Running. God, what do you frickin' do about this, man? Sure can't. Can't do anything there. Ow. Ow. I really got no idea what I'm doing. Can you tell? Oh, hello. Yeah, you have fun with that. Yeah, I'm just... You know what? I can probably craft some ammo, can't I? Okay. No. No. Well, I guess let's just... What's this again? See how this would work as a board game for people who are invested in it. But for people like me, I just don't get invested in this type of thing. Like, I just. Mm -mm. Oh, there's an arrow in my leg. How about that? 
That's not how you pull those arrows out, by the way, buddy. Just sitting there with a hole in your hand and missing pinky and part of your other finger. Yeah, it's bandage up. That'll make it all better. Bandages fix everything, didn't you know that? Oh. Wait. Wait. Can I come with you, lady? Apparently I can. Ooh, achievement. Not like can this. Oh, snap. Yeah, come on. Let's follow the old lady. In life and in death, we give glory. Are you drawn uh, there? Hello? You shouldn't be out here. It's not safe. What the hell? Hey, can you hear me? Oh, it's you. The child's father. Child? Hey, wait. Do you mean Rose? Is she here? <laughs> Rose! Rose, yes. She is in great danger. Since Mother Miranda brought her to the village, we have fallen into darkness. What are you talking about? The monsters? So Bell heralds danger. They're coming. <laughs> no, okay. Wait, where's Rose? Who's Mother Miranda? The bell tolls for us all. Okay. They're coming again. <laughs> just a classic witch archetype. Rose is here? Even the cackling of her, it's just like, well, what are you doing? Like, I know this isn't supposed to be camp last I knew. It's Resident Evil is supposed to be a thing of its own and not just catering to standard tropes. I don't know. Ooh, pretty. Like the decor. Bunch of old lady floral. Okay, what's in here? Easy to pick lock. Okay. So, can I pick it? <coughs> I guess not. Well, I need tools to do that. Oh, great lichens, the fabled monster wolves of old. May they come to eat our flesh. May they come to tear us apart. Uh, yeah, whatever. Cam fluid, good. I believe I got some more, um... Ooh, I'm all healthy again. Uh... Here for me, so anything back here? Nope. Ugh. I'm just already drained. Yeah, let's view the map. Okay. I can zoom. Middle mouse to move around. Alright, so look for Rose. Oh, there's a lockpick. Or does it need a lockpick? It needs lockpick. Okay, so great, whatever. Ugh. This really just makes me want to play more Breakpoint. Or anything, honestly. What's over here? We got glowing stuff that I can mess with. Need some kind of other item. Of course it does. You know, I never really liked adventure games when I played them as a kid. Nah, down here. Can't go in there, so never mind. It's that fancy statue. Facing the graveyard. There's a crow. Ooh, here's this. What's this? Salmon. Okay, so probably shouldn't break that, I guess. I really don't care. Ugh. And 
that has all sigils I'm supposed to place in it, I assume. Let's look in here. Use typewriter to save your progress. <laughs> Alright. We'll save. Why not? Yeah, a little churchy thingy. Oh, there's one of the sigil thingies, the crest I'm supposed to place in it. Louise's house. Alright, so that's great. Yeah. Oh, I like how the lead is kind of shiny. Where it's really thick. That's cool. Yeah. Rink. Okay, Louise's house is down here. Oh, no. I'm just really, really hating this. I hate horror games so much. It's like, here, let's just try and scare you and make you feel weak. There's something in there, but I can't get in there. Let me in. It's been 50 minutes. I've been playing for 50 minutes. That's enough. I saved. I gotta decide if I want to refund this or not. Put in under two hours. I have to start. <laughs> and then hit delete to quit. It's so dumb. And the UI for this is just... bland. But, alright, so. Post game question and answer. Let's. We have one viewer right now. How about that? You got anything for me? Anything you want to say? Mm. I say. Yeah, it's a horror game. I hate it. General thoughts. I don't know. It's pretty. Mm. It's that whole, you know, your weak, lacking resources intro, like always. You know, I can't really say too much about the game because I haven't given it a full fair shake, and I honestly don't know if I want to, just because I hate horror games so much. They're so boring, and stressful. Oh, which is kind of an oxymoron, but like when I'm bored and not invested in something, it makes me more stressed and I don't know. Like, I'm not even a huge fan of survival type games, honestly, but I would rather play a run-of-the-mill survival than this. And this is coming from, you know, once again, this is someone who hates horror games. I do not like horror games at all so yeah but all right i don't think we're going to stream this one again it's not worth it for for me <sighs> yeah y'all want to probably want to find a streamer who actually likes horror games if this is what you're into but honestly, it plays like a standard horror game. Every horror game I've played so far plays out just like this in the intro. Casual setting, everything's all hunky-dory, then it goes into the, oh, something happened, drama. And then, uh, it's just, it plays out like the standard horror stuff. Now, I have cheated, and I've, uh, checked out reviews from other sources, Rock, Paper, Shotgun, and a few others, and yeah, they're, you know, the chief complaints are that it's a little more action-y, and that's okay, I guess. Um, I thought maybe it might 
draw me in a little more. It, it tends, it actually is, is supposed to get more action later on, and especially later on in the game where you have more resources uh, and, and you're more better equipped to handle all the monsters, but I hate how, like, you saw how many headshots it took to take down one of those guys, where it's just like, well, what do you frickin' do, you know? Nah, not enjoying this game one bit, and... <sighs> yeah, this is definitely a Steam refund for me. I wasted an hour of my evening playing this game. Maybe you're thinking, Will, why are you complaining? Why, why'd you stream this? It's because I wanted to try something different. You know, horror games and stealth go hand in hand as of late. Um, and hmm, here to give it a shot. This so far does not have stealth mechanics really. I mean, I could have tried to creep around maybe, but there was no indication of any stealth. So. This was just a big old waste of time. And on that, catch you jerks later.